Hey, what's up guys? Rob Balasabas here. Hope you're doing really well. I'm really excited for this new update that Slack just released, at least to me on my Slack account, this new feature. And this feature hopefully will get you excited as well. Hopefully will save you a ton of time. I know it is already saving me time today when I started using it. And that is the audio voicemail feature and also the video message feature built in natively inside of Slack. So if you're a Slack user, if you've been thinking about using Slack um, and uh, you are not a typer like me, if you know me, if you're connected with me and you're sending me messages on Facebook Messenger or Instagram or even LinkedIn, you'll know that I love voice messages. I send voice messages all the time because I'm not big on typing. I have very big thumbs and I just don't like typing on a phone um, or even on a, on a, on a desktop and uh, on a keyboard. And so I use voice messages very, very frequently. And so I'm really excited that Slack finally released this. Now, when you open up your Slack account, what you'll see is this. So you'll see this is your typical message box when you want to send into a uh, thread or into a direct message, this is what you'll find. Now, you will then see two new buttons. You'll see this one right here, which is a audio message button. And then you'll also see this one, which is a video message button, okay? And this is really cool. Now this, let's tackle the video, the audio message first, okay? The audio messages first. And so when you click this audio message button right here, you will then have this pop-up, which is a recording right inside, built in inside of Slack. So you can connect whatever microphone you want. I use different microphones as you can see here. So you can connect your laptop microphone, your built-in microphone, you can connect an external microphone, whatever you like, and it will then record. Once you're done recording, actually first, if you're not happy with the recording, you can press the X on the top right here and then you can press that same button again to re-record, right? It will open up this button again, this, this interface again, and you can start recording again. Now, I did find that it records instantly, so as soon as you uh, press that record button, it will automatically start recording. And so once you're done recording, you press the blue check mark here that you see on the screen, and then what'll happen is that it puts that audio message inside of the message box. Now you can still add where it says jot something down, down there, down, down there. Uh, you can still add a message. You know, you want to add some context. You want to add a link to something, whatever you want. You can still add to that message to go along with the audio message. Okay. Awesome tool, right? Uh, if you love this tool, let me know in the chat. I love this, I love this feature. I love this feature. It's saving me so much time already, sending some messages to team members by audio so I don't have to type it out. And it's also probably eliminating some back and forth from like clarifying something. I can just explain much, much easier in a voice message. Now, the next thing that Slack did is then release video messages, right? So you see this button right here, video message. It's got the little icon of a camera right there, when you press that, it opens this up. Sorry about the funny face here, <laughs> uh, but this is what you'll, it'll open up an actual video uh, box. You can select, press the setting button right there. I can't press right there, right there. On the bottom left of that box, press settings, and you can select which camera you like. You can select your, you know, if you have an external camera, your laptop camera, webcam, whatever you like, you can select the camera. You can also select which microphone you prefer. All right, so very cool. You then press record, that, that red record button on the bottom right of that box, and it will record everything that happens there. Now, I can show you in feature videos, but you can also share your screen, which is awesome, especially if you wanna show someone, you know, you're doing some collaborations, you're working with a team member, you wanna share exactly what's on your screen, you can do that as well, all right? Now, once you've recorded, it goes into the message box, just like this. So you'll see it right here um, on the bottom right, bottom left there, you'll see that little uh, thumbnail of the video recording. 
and you can, again, just like the audio message, you can add something to the message. You can add some text, links, whatever you like, emojis, whatever you like, and uh, you can send that along with the video message that you recorded all on Slack. You don't need any other, you know, video recording tools or apps or anything. Everything can be done right here inside of Slack, and that is in my opinion, amazing. I love, I love Slack. I use Slack all the time and on a daily basis. And I think this is fantastic that they finally rolled these two features out. So let me know what you think of those two features. If you have any questions uh, that I can create feature videos on to clarify it, let me know. Again, my name is Rob Balasabas. Check out these other videos that you see on the screen. Make sure you subscribe and like this video as well. And uh, I'll see you in the next video. Thanks so much. Take care.